guys and welcome to my first Christmas video. As you kind of guess my second because I've done an advent calendar video this year already. But welcome to my ball ball and Christmas cracker video. I must admit I was hoping that my background would be a little bit more festive but I just haven't had time. Hopefully tomorrow's video will be more festive. I am however wearing a festive jumper. It says sleigh ride. But sleigh like sleigh rather than sleigh as in Santa sleigh. Now I'm not gonna lie I don't have too much time to film this video today so we're gonna have to get through it quite quickly. I'm actually off to an event really randomly with Jared Butler. He's launching a Hugo Boss fragrance. I've also been rained on and I didn't sleep very much which is why I look so great and awake today but seriously I've written a list and I have so much to talk about so let's get started with crackers. So first up there's a few different box sets of crackers this year. The first one I have to show you is the Sanctuary Enjoy and Let Go, a sumptuous surprise inside each cracker. These are actually really really pretty, there's four crackers and they're all different design and inside you get a body wash or a body lotion which is really cute and I just think they're really nice. I believe these are £10 but I could, I'm not 100% sure so I'm going to leave these and everything else linked down below but these are really pretty. They don't have a pull, I don't think any of my crackers have an actual like pull, like a, a bang. Does that make sense? I don't know if that makes sense. Do bear in mind that these sanctuary ones are available from Boots as are these and another box I have. These are the Champ Knees um, original crackers and these are £10 and inside these you have shower gel and body lotion and shower cream. Again, really pretty to look at. Not too expensive, they work out at £2.50 each. But the products inside are slightly smaller than the ones in the Sanctuary set as well. And then there's one from number seven, which I think is really nice. It's got makeup inside instead of body lotion and body cream. And inside you can either have nail polishes or lip balms. Yeah, there's four different nail colours and two different lip balms. So I assume the lip balms are in every set. Then there's variations of the nail polishes. The nail polishes are a pearlescent red and then a shimmery gold. But I think this one's really nice and it's on the free for two. As are the other ones, I believe. And these work out at £3.50 £3 each. So they're a little bit more expensive than the other ones but you get makeup rather than body product. Now if you're on a bit of a budget, these are just five pounds, which I think is so good. And inside there are three different crackers and these are from Accessorize. And the reason I like these is because I just think they're really pretty. Let's see if we can open it. And inside they've got little bar fizzes. I just think they're so pretty and just so affordable as well. I actually said these are five pounds, but they're six pounds, making each cracker two pounds, so really affordable. They're the cheapest ones we've seen so far. The Heath Coat and Ivory Atlas Silks Buff Fizzer Crackers. These have three inside, and these are five pounds, so really, really affordable. And I just love the design on these. I think they're a little bit different, kind of like Oriental inspired. I just think they're so beautiful. And also from Heath Coat and Ivory, there are these Fabric and Flowers Vintage & Co Cracker Gift Sets. This is a set of five and these are £12. Again, really, really beautiful. And inside there is, I think a loofah. Oh no, there's hand cream and bath fizzes. So really nice and you don't have to know the person too well. I think most women love bath fizzes and hand cream, so that's a really nice one again. But another one that's kind of maybe for a younger age group but one I really like is a Zoella set. They look like this on the outside and there's four different crackers. Oh they're really cute. They have like little questions on the back, like little jokes. What's the best Christmas present in the world? A broken drum, you just can't beat it. That's a cute one. I'll save the rest of the jokes for anyone that wants to buy them. But inside this one, inside this one there is a hand cream, body cream, body wash and lip balm and just really cute for anyone that is a Zoella fan. And I must admit I'm actually quite a big Zoella fan. I don't know if she's necessarily for my age group, but her vlogs are just the best in my opinion. On to singular crackers. This one is from Sienna X and it's called the Winter Hint. Hit. Winter Hit. Let's open it and see what's inside. Kind of wasn't expecting this, but there's a pair of rubber gloves. And then there is also a high intensity tanning express one hour tan, which is cute. And I believe this one is £10, but it's quite difficult to find online, but I think you might be able to get it in salons that stock Sienna X. Feel Unique have a cracker, and I'm personally quite excited about this one. I might actually keep this one for myself. It's a Feel Unique Beauty Tools Cracker and it's £10 so it's quite expensive for a singular one but it's it's quite a good gift rather than just a cracker that you'd use at the table in my opinion. I can't remember what's inside but it looks like there's a beauty blender and a nail file. Let's just open it. I'm going to keep this one anyway. Okay inside this one there is 
a little mini sparkly nail file, some brushes and a little travel case that's really cute. It's called the Essential Eye Brush Capsule Collection and then a Feel Unique brand beauty blender. Next onto the Lost Tan one, I actually think I've got a singular one of this but they come in a pack and this is the Lost Tan Sweet Time Cracker and this is super cute because they've got a variety of products inside. So inside mine there is a shower gel, a really adorable perfect travel size hand cream and a olive bath cube so really really adorable perfect like christmas time minis i think and you can get either a trio for 20 pounds or the singular ones for 10 pounds then on to quarterly and they are very similar to the feel unique ones in my opinion inside mine they probably do vary it comes wrapped which none of the other ones have but inside is a few products again I can already feel it and there is a quarterly vino sauce moisturizing sorbet a moisturizing mask and then also an SOA an SOS first quenching serum that sounds perfect for a post-party pamper also if you like fake tan there is the Saint Tropez luxe oil party cracker and they've got a few different ones with different products inside different price points as well this one I believe is 10 and inside is the self tan luxe dry oil which I've heard really good things about and actually I think it's a really reasonable price for a 50 ml bottle now that's actually all the crackers I think there are some really really lovely ones this year but let's go on to baubles because I have even more baubles than I have crackers. As well as doing crackers, Lossitan have released a bauble. They've released this bauble ever since I can remember, actually. Well, for a few years. It looks like this. It's an actual bauble rather than a Christmas tree ornament. Don't know if I'm going to be able to open it, though. I think I've got a few of these on my Christmas tree already because I just save them every year. But I don't think I can open this one. So I'm not going to be able to show you inside. But you can tell on the outside, this is the Shea Butter Christmas Ball Ornament. So inside there is a body lotion, soap and a hand cream as well, which is really nice. And it's the cl classic Shea Butter scent. On to fragrance, and I have two different ball balls to talk about. The first one is from Ghost, and if you have any friends that are a Ghost fragrance lover, then this one's really cute. Inside there is a lip gloss and a fragrance. And it's only £8, which I think is so, so affordable. The lip gloss is 5ml and then the fragrance is 10ml so it's a really nice travel fragrance. And then Miss Sarah Jessica Parker. For any friends that are an SJP fan or a Sex and City fan, she's also released this really adorable bauble. By the way, baubles are really hard to open. And inside there is the SJP NYC fragrance. It is just the cutest little bottle and it comes with a pump, which I always feel like is really important. This smells so good. I'm definitely keeping this fragrance for myself. The perfect little handbag fragrance. That is a still at only five pounds. This year I only have one nail polish Christmas tree ornament. I'm not sure if Mavala have theirs this year or Topshop, but Ciate have this really cute little duo. I am loving Ciate at the moment. I know I've said that before, but I think it's a really lovely brand. And particularly this little polish here, which is called Antique Brooch, is just so, so beautiful. And both polishes are 5 mil, so they're quite a nice size. And these are £10, so I guess you're paying £5 for each polish, which I think is really reasonable as well. Let's talk about makeup. And 17 have their Colour Blast Ball Ball Duo, which is £6. It looks like this. The polish inside this is so amazing. It's like really glittery. And then it's also got a lip luster, which for me is a bit of a bright colour. But if you have a friend that's a little bit more daring, I think that's quite a cute little one as well. It's a bit of a different shape to the other ones as well. As always, Topshop have released ball balls as well. These are the most flimsy packaging wise, and they don't really look very expensive. Or even overly festive, but I have two, and both of them are lip bullets. Yeah, one's matte, one isn't. And these are five pounds, which I think is quite nice. And you can kind of pick a colour that your friend would really like. And Topshop makeup is really good as well. Another tr more traditional ball-shaped ball ball is from Heathcote and Ivory Atlas Silk, and this is the perfect duo ball ball. And inside it has two hand creams, a hand cream and a hand gel, and it's really pretty. It's got it's got that more like oriental feel to it. I really like it. Um, I would actually be tempted to once I finished with it, kind of 
decorate the plastic bauble myself. And for some reason I didn't write the price of this one down, but it's going to be linked down below. It's quite a grown up bauble, I think. For anyone that's a Veleda or Veleda, I'm still not sure how to pronounce it, fan, they've got quite a few different baubles this year. I think they're about the £8 mark. This is the Wild Rose Body Wash, and then this one here is a little duo. It's got a hand cream and another hand cream. I'd probably go for the hand cream ones. I think hand cream makes a really nice gift for someone that you don't know too well, because not everyone likes makeup, but everyone likes a good hand cream, I think. Quarterly also has a tree ornament, eight pounds from them, and this is the Divine Oil Bauble. Um, quite cute. I feel like they've made a bit more effort than the Topshop one has, just because they've got like the cardboard tops. I actually do quite like this oil, it's quite a versatile oil. And there's 15 mil in this oil, so I think that's quite a nice price as well. This one's from Accessorize, and oh, it's just so, so pretty. I really like this little addition of this little chain, which I'm gonna take off and put on my bag or my purse, I think. And inside this one is a lip balm. Again, really pretty shape. I think that would actually look quite nice on a tree. It's a citrus twist lip balm, which has bee wax and hints of sweet caramel, which sounds pretty nice. Then one that I'm gonna admit doesn't look overly glam is the Heathcote and Ivory Gardeners SOS Balm, but it has a multi-purpose balm inside. And I think it's quite a nice idea. It looks a little bit more, I don't know, unisex and a bit more outdoorsy, I would say. It's like a little shed. Then my three top picks. We've saved the best till last, but these are in no particular order. This is the Nils Yard Wild Rose Beauty Balm Bauble. Look how pretty that is. That's, it looks really luxe. You could definitely put that on a Christmas tree. And this one's £12.50, making it the most expensive bauble, I believe, that I've spoken about. But inside you get a cleanser, and I love the Wild Rose Beauty Balm Cleanser. It's so amazing, especially for this type of weather. It removes makeup amazingly and is really hydrating, so it's a great one for anyone that's into their skincare. One that I think always looks like really posh is the Molten Brown, because it comes in a fancy box. And inside is the bauble. Really, really beautiful. Looks like this. You get a whole variety of colours. So if you wanted to put it on your Christmas tree, you could get one that goes with your colour theme. And inside is a 75ml body wash. This is the Temple Tree one, which is which smells really nice as well. And I just think the colours are beautiful and it looks like a real proper bauble. And we're gonna finish off with another tree ornament, not really a bauble. But it's from Too Faced, and you guys know I love Too Faced, and I particularly love the Better Than Sex Mascara. And this one is £10, and it comes with a little mini Better Than Sex Mascara. I'm probably going to keep this for myself again to travel with. And I think Christmas is always such a great time to pick up things to travel with um, throughout the rest of the year. And if you haven't tried this mascara, it's also a nice way to try the mascara and not pay the full £22, I believe. And that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was somewhat informative. A little bit different for my Mail Mondays, I know, but... This is all new and you haven't seen it, so I hope it kind of still counts as a Mail Monday. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to follow me on Snapchat. My Snapchat is a little obsessed. My Instagram is also linked down below. And I shall see you tomorrow for another video. Bye.